Compute for You started business in 2002 and revenue grew rapidly after that. Revenue for several years are given in the table. We're asked to write an equation for a model of these data. So what I'll do here is I'll say let t or x doesn't really matter. I'll let t represent uh, years, the years since uh, 2000, and I will let r of t represent uh, the revenue, and that's in millions of dollars. So to determine the type of model to use, I'm going to look at the data points uh, on a scatter plot. All right, so let's do that. Calculator, stat, edit. All right, so my data points, are, my t values are 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And my outputs are 2.1. 3.68, and 34.48, and all of those are in millions of dollars. All right, so let's get a reasonable window here. Uh, my window, I'm going to go from 0 to 11 on the x-axis and by ones and on the y's let's go from zero million dollars to forty million dollars and I'll use a scale of I don't know how about ten alright let's turn the stat plot on and let's look at the graph and I have a grid on as well and so what I see here is I see a rapid growth and if I look at that it looks to me like an exponential function so let's use an exponential model so I want R of T to be equal to some a times b to the t power. I'm going to use the first and last data points. So I'm going to use 5, 2.1, and 10, 34.48. And we've seen how to do this in the previous chapter, but what I will do is I will use the second ordered pair first. So then 34.48 is equal to a times b to the tenth and 2.1 is equal to a times b to the fifth. Dividing through term, term wise yields well, 34.48 over 2.1 is not a nice number. I'll just leave it like that. Just leave it as 34.48 over 2.1 the a's reduce out and we're left with b to the fifth on the right hand side and so then that implies that b is 34.48 over 2.1 to the one-fifth power so let's go to the cal calculator 34 point four eight over two point one raise that to the one fifth power and that gives us approximately one point seven five all right so b is approximately one point seven five let's go back and solve for a so i'm just going to use the first equation there thirty four point four eight is equal to a times 1.75 to the tenth power. So that means that A is equal to 34.48 divided by 1.75 to the tenth. And calculate that. 34.48 divided by 
1.75 to the 10th power is about 0.128. All right, so putting that together then, my model, hopefully, is R of t is 0 0.128 by 1.75 to the t. Let's go ahead and check that by graphing it along with our data points. So y equals 0 0.128 times 1.75 and raise that to the x power. Graph it. And that appears to fit our data very well. All right, so we can be confident with that model. Find when the revenue will reach $100 million. So we want R of t to be equal to 100, right, because our revenue is in millions of dollars. So R of t is 0 0.128 by 1.75 to the t, and we need that to be 100. Now I can't write this in an, so to solve for t, I'm going to write this in a logarithmic form and use the change of base rule. But I can't do that just yet because I don't have the exponential part isolated. So I will isolate the exponential part by dividing by 0.128. All right, so 100 divided by 0.128 is 781.25. So I have 1.75 to the t. is equal to 781.25. Now, I'm going to rewrite this in its logarithmic form. So t would equal the log base 1.75 of 781.25 and use the change of base rule. So that would be the log, let me clear that up a little bit. So then t would equal the log of 781.25 divided by the log of 1.75. Let's check that out on the calculator. Log 781.25 divided by log 1.75 is 11.9 approximately. Now remember that t was the number of years since 2000. So 11.9 is about 12, so that would mean the year 2012. Conclusion. In 2012, the revenue will reach $100 million.